Hey everyone, welcome to this week's Stout Advice. Uh, for all of you in the Stout Mentoring Program, I know it's quite unbelievable and it's, it's exciting. If you haven't looked into it, go to loganstout.com, check it out. All right, the topic for this week is personal forgiveness. You know, typically when we hear the word forgive, we imply we're going to forgive someone else, right? Which is, which is fine. But a lot of times we can beat ourselves up. And here's what I want you to know. You're not gonna be the best you can be today or tomorrow if in your mind you're still focusing and dwelling on something you did or didn't do yesterday or prior to, right? There's three time frames: Yesterday, tomorrow, and now. And I wanna encourage all of you right now, if, if there's something that you, know, you haven't done and you have a regret, welcome to the family, all right? We, we all have those. There's all things we look back on, I'm like, what, what was I thinking, right? And sometimes, what I've realized in life is that it's not sometimes, the majority of the population, uh, that lack of forgiveness on oneself leads to these handcuffs that people sort of go through in life. And it leads to insecurity, fear, uh, stagnation, and quite frankly, it leads to people just accepting life versus designing their life. And so uh, I'm giving you permission this week on Stat Advice. I'm giving you permission. Forgive yourself, right? If you did something wrong, uh, you know, stop dwelling on the past. You can't focus all your energy, effort, and attention on the here and now and moving forward if you're, if you're so focused on what you did or didn't do in the past, okay? I hope that adds value to your life. I hope you'll receive that because, look, you are here on this earth at this moment to make this world a better place. And so don't be so hard on yourself, okay? Don't be so hard on yourself. That's my stat advice for the week. I love you very much. Thank you for tuning in, and I can't wait to see you next week.